Hey everybody, Grimer here coming at you once again from Subnautica. Let's get in this beast, alright? We gotta do some traveling, alright? We gotta do some things. Uh, because we have to get down to the alien containment facility. Kind of like the objective was last episode, except for I found out I needed the blue key. We're doing it this episode, because I did manage to get the blue key in the last episode, if you watched it. Spoiler, if you didn't. Uh, it was pretty epic, actually. The Sea Dragon Leviathan proved to be quite a problem down there. But we survived, didn't we? We're here, aren't we? So, all right, we have to get back down to the inactive lava zone. Um, and I'm going to take the prawn suit down there so that I can actually get down there. Um, and then uh, we also have to get down underneath, like, where the sea castle or that lava castle thing was. Because that's where we found the alien facility last time. I said in the last episode that I was going to bring beacons. I didn't. I completely forgot again. That would probably make my life a lot easier if I would remember those things. Kind of wondering whether I should turn back and get them. Nah, we'll be fine. All right, we're just going for it. So we did see the, the ghost in the last episode as well, and that was a lot of fun. I don't know what that is yet. I'm guessing it has to do with something here on the planet. I mean, it, it, it's got to be like the alien species that built the place or something. I don't know what it is, but whatever it is, we're going to find out in this episode, hopefully in this episode. All right, so I'm going to make my way down to the deep drop off, and I'll be right back with you guys. Am I flying on this fish? Am I flying on the fish that I grappled? Is that what, what just happened right there? I think I killed the fish by doing that. But I was I grappled the fish and then I looked down and was running on it. How awesome is that? Let's see if I can do it again. Alright, doesn't look like I can run on him this time. Alright, there is the sea dragon leviathan. Still alive, wasn't able to kill it last episode. I don't really know if I'm going to try this one either. I'm probably just going to evade it if I can. All right, I do have to find the drop off leading down to the lava zone, and that actually might be where my beacon is, because that's where I found it the first time. So let's head over there. You go away. All right, we made it to my beacon here, the super deep drop off. Let's get down here, because I got to find my way that way. That's where I want to go. Nope, think I'm too far off the ridge. Got it. This is the where I want to be heading, because this is where we found the facility before. I do have the blue key, right? Yes, I do. Okay, I was like, that'd be really embarrassing if I got all the way down here and I forgot, I forgot the keys. Just like last episode. So in case you're wondering, I made it all the way down here last time by just swimming and creating a fob. Uh, a little ballsy, really, when you think about it, but uh, that's how I did it. Um, it was just with a sea glide. <laughs> but, uh, this time I obviously did it the correct way and used the prawn suit. I'm just spider-manning across the roof here uh, to get across the lava instead of trying to jump across. Oh, this could be a problem. I didn't even grab the bottom like I, I meant to. There we go, let's get down here. That sea dragon, you don't see nothing. I'm not here. All right, we're in. We are in like Flynn. All right, we have the, the blue key. All right, let's actually do this. Let's not waste any further ado. Let's get in here. Blue key, in there. All right, alien. All right, ghost. Whatever you are, you want to talk to me now? Because uh, can I? I'm I'm bringing this. This sometimes gets a little buggy, so this might be a mistake. We're gonna save right here at the beginning, so that in case it does bug out, I don't get screwed over. Can I just walk up? There? Well, that's pretty cool. That was pretty welcoming. Because I see this, I kind of want to mine it. Translating local alien broadcast. Warning, vaccine development program terminated. That's unfortunate. Egg hatching project terminated. Life specimens terminated. Evacuate immediately. Well, that doesn't help me at all. Was there like a little spider thing I saw behind this crawling around out there? Because uh, if there is, that kind of freaks me out. All right, I broke the center, the center thing. What do you think about that? Oh, I did something. You. Are you a dead thing or are you a living thing? You look like a dead thing. All right, time to get the scanner out. There's some things here. Uh, rudimentary tablet. Uh, circular object. Holographic projector. Okay, what's this? Alien something. Alien statue. 
strange carving. It's like a yin yang sign. What, what's up with that? Why is that here? Is that more of an earth thing? Visit earth prior to the. Tw oh, see, look at that. They, I told you it was an earth thing. Ancient blade, aka sword, baby. I want that. Can I please take that? Oh, God, there's something here. Alien robot. What is this? Uh, assessment. Immobilize and return to Altair for mutual profit. Okay. Immobilize, huh? Stay right there. I gotta I gotta stab you with a knife. Uh I think I blew it up. Okay, never mind. That was really immobilizing it apparently. Alright, well, what the Dude, that's some awesome lights. I want that in like my Oh, is this more stuff being made? Is there more stuff in there? Huh? No? Okay, that's strange. There's another one of those guys. I wonder if they attack me. I wonder if I'm going to get my, my butt beat up by those, those things. Alien object. Not sure what this thing is. Is it a boomerang? Is that thing flying in the back? I need to know if this thing's going to attack me. Are you going to attack me? Are you dangerous in any way, shape, or form? Can I ride on you? Oh, it is a, it is dangerous. Okay. Yeah, be gone. Okay, there we go. Killed it. Okay, so those things are dangerous. Good to know. All right, let's get back to scanning some of this stuff. Unusual box. Hmm. This device contains highly unstable radioactive isotope. Good. Empty case. Oh, can I make this thing now? Is this the blueprint that I can do then? It's not possible. I would hover. I was really. Oh, there's nanobots in there. Alien technology. All right, what's this thing? A translation device. All right, let's continue on. I think I scanned all the things. Oh, yeah, it is creating more. That's all it's doing. It just makes more of this stuff. Nifty. So that's what that thing was doing. So I could... I, okay, I have an unlimited supply of that stuff if I want it. Oh, no, prawn suit. Don't do this. No, the prawn suit's doing a stupid thing again. Okay, there. Fixed it. That's really annoying when that does that. Don't hit the thrusters. Got it. All right, let me actually leave the prawn suit right here and continue on on foot. So awesome. All right, let's get up here. It looks like there's a data bank thing right there. This is a large facility. It's going to take me a little bit to get through this, I think. Enzyme 42 project data. According to the translated data, the, the indigenous Leviathan species were found to produce a unique substance referred to as Enzyme 42, which inhibited the symptoms of the CRA bacteria infection uh, in other indigenous organisms. The specimen was captured and contained in a purpose-built habitat for further study. Alien research... Uh, researchers went to great lengths to provide uh, to provide for the life form environment environmental needs, uh, including the import of interdeterminate flora, interdepend interdependent flora, flora and fauna via the on-site uh, warp page or warp gate. Oh, that's the thing. Oh, there's an on-site warp gate here. However, its health quickly deteriorated. Uh, when quarantine uh, was imposed, all warp gates were forcibly uh, and force fields were sealed in an attempt to develop an enzyme into a vaccine, which was has been unsuccessful. Dang it! Come on, you guys. You got to make this successful. My life depends on it. All right, there's other side rooms down here before I go into that big one up there. Uh, it looks like there's a force field right there, too. I want to explore these side rooms first. want to get it all. Get all the things. I also have to hurry up because my food and water isn't exactly looking great, so... I mean, it's, it's not bad. It's just it's not looking great. Is there anything up here? Okay, here's one of those gates. Ah, uh, insert cube. Oh, it's in the... It's in the... What the heck is that? Uh, F8. F8, people. There's there's a bug. All right, so the, here is one of those, uh, one of those gates. Uh, I just need to insert a cube, which I do have in the prawn suit. So let me get back there real quick and go grab that. And then I can up, get this gate going. See where it connects? Let's start this bad boy. Well, might as well walk through, see what happens. Oh, it's not the thermal plant, that's for sure. What is that? It's just a light. I'm just staring at a light. Where is this place? Oh, this is in the... Um, I've been here. This is where I, I took the Cyclops for its main voyage. 
Okay, so apparently there's a alien facility here that I didn't know about. Crazy stuff. All right, what, what's behind door number two now? That was what was behind the first side room. Oh, boy. Is that a water slide? I want to ride it. Oh, here we go. Let's just check this. Integrating Ventilation control. Water flow. Okay, so this is this is how it gets oxygen. It's pulling the oxygen from the water, it looks like. Some crazy stuff. I hear droid things all around me. I don't want them to eat my leg. And these are some nice aquariums, though. It sucks that probably everything inside them is dead. Inflow pipe. All right, uh, Peeper's engineering the containment facilities, or Peeper's entering the containment facilities. The pipes draw water into the containment facility are filled with Peeper's arrived from the, arriving from the surface. The fish show no signs of distress. The specimens scanned all have consumed high quantities of seeds and organic matter from the surface. Some specimens are, are beginning to show signs of infection. Oh, that's not good. So this is, oh, maybe this is how they just draw things from the surface. Let's get back to the prawn suit and get some water and then uh, explore door number three. The way creepy uh, robot bug. This almost reminds me of the dwarven ruins in Skyrim. All right, what do we got up here? Oh, it's another one's gate. Good thing I grabbed one of those cubes. All right, let's use it. Because I have an infinite supply of this, apparently. I mean, it was generating it at the facility. All right, where does this take me? Another cave someplace. Where is this one? Oh, boy. Oh, there is a mushroom biome. Look at that. All right, so I'm in one of the mushroom fields. I don't want to get lost down here, though, because this is not my primary uh, primary goal. So I'm going to stay uh, kind of stay close to this uh, Stargate and get back then. All right, once I get back, though, we're on to door number four. Checking these side rooms. I want to make sure I can check this whole facility over. Plus, I wouldn't doubt if there's... like It looked like there's a force field kind of barrier straight in front on the main chamber. I'm guessing there's a key that's supposed to go there. So, uh, it's time for me to find that. Alright, so like this chamber right here. Like, yeah, that's totally a force field right there, right? And there's a key slot. What, what kind of key do I need? Another blue one? Boy, I hope there's a blue tablet somewhere in this facility. Alright, let's check door number four. Alright, open sesame. Where does this take me? Okay, another creepier cave. This looks like the under. This looks the like the underside of the Lost River. This looks like the Lost River. Oh, there's a ghost leviathan right there, and some terrible things also. You know what? I'm good. We're in the Lost River. Some. Oh, is that thing coming at me? It is. How are you in here? Get out of here. Shoo! How are you even in here? This is air. You shouldn't. Okay, we're just we're we're dipping. We're dipping out of here. Can I just like scale this? Can I just climb up right here? Huh? Oh yeah, I can. Look at that shortcut. All those years of Mario Kart finally paid off. All right, now door number five. I still haven't found the orange or the the blue key though. Is that something I have to make? That's gonna be so crappy if I have to get out of here just to go make it. What kind of crazy nightmares is going on here? It to be a biological archive storing more than 40 indigenous egg specimens in different states of development. Did you say 40? Let me get my scanner. Oh, here we go. Maybe this is like all of them right here. Sea Emperor Leviathan research data. New PDA data. Okay, it says uh, size specimen, uh, sp specimen size categories have been adjusted upward to accommodate this species. Uh, feeding and digestion alien research data indicates that despite its size, uh, the species feeds entirely on microorganisms and apparently prawn suits. Uh, it filters from the water, which themselves depend on a complicated ecosystem of plant and animal life. Reproduction. Uh, large ovary-like organs uh, are carried in the creature's middle section. Suggestions Suggesting that, uh, like other species on this planet, it produces eggs. However, uh, interior scar tissue indicates possible infertility. Enzyme 42, that's what I'm interested in. The Emperor manufactures Enzyme 42 which, uh, within its stomach cavity to break down its food. 
and will occasionally expel it uh, into the surrounding waters. Uh, this substance was found to neutralize the effects of the bacterium and its presence in the ecosystem. Today would uh, would also explain how life on this planet survived the outbreak. Uh, it would remain. It would. Uh, it would remain to be explained uh, by what mechanism the enzyme is being delivered. Okay, let's jump down to the assessment. Because the health, uh, that's great. Oh, okay, so it's approximately 1,600 years old. Okay, uh, assessment. While a healthy emperor specimen may have uh, held some potential as a cure, it is unlikely any research subject survived quarantine procedures. Okay, so a healthy uh, sea dragon leviathan is what I'm looking for. Can I just hatch one from an egg? I can make a little aquarium, put them in there with squidge and squidge. So, all right, let's go on to door number six, the final room. There better be a blue key in there. All right, what do we got in here? Ooh, okay, I do have some uh, some of this stuff on me, right? Yeah, I do. Okay, let's see where this one takes me. Hopefully it takes me to a chamber with a blue key in it, because uh, I don't have anywhere else to go. All right, it takes me to a cave with a robo-spider in it. Nice. Um, okay, is this a whiny path? Excuse me, Robo Spider. Have you seen a blue key anywhere? It's a pretty cave and all, but I'm looking for a blue key salt pile here on the ground. Don't really know where this is, but it's definitely not a blue key. Okay, so uh, that means I need to do a little bit of research because uh, I need to know where. I need to know where a blue key is, or if I can manufacture one. A few moments later. All right, you got to be kidding me. Okay, so I did some research and looked up. It is craftable after you pick it up or scan it, like what I did. Which means I got to go back to the fob so that I can craft this thing. All right, made it back here. Let me just craft these things, get some food, and be on my way. Yep, there it is. Blue tablet. Dang it. All right, let's get back in the prawn. All right, we made it back. No problem whatsoever. All right, we got the blue key. We got all the teleporters in this area turned on, I believe. There's not a second floor. All right, let's open this door. And please don't need another blue key. All right, what was so important that I had to go get that? Oh, this is the specimen chamber, isn't it? This is the chamber where they keep that uh, sea dragon leviathan, or is it a... Yeah, I, I think I've been mispronouncing it this entire time. I think it's called an Emperor Leviathan, actually. The Sea Dragon Leviathan was a thing that breathes fire that's out there. Okay, I see no other place to go other than in the water, which... That seems like a bad idea. Screw it, let's go in. Okay, there's terrible things in here. Oh, oh, jeez! Oh, jeez! Knife! Um. Oh. Are you here to play? Uh. Others came here once. They built these walls. I think this thing's they friendly. Alone. This is the thing that's been they contacting me. me. Now they're gone. And instead, we have you. Hi, my name's Grimer. We are curious whether you swim with current or fight against it as they did whatever answer gets me off this planet can I scan this thing can I should I shoot this thing um, I need to go a little bit faster I want to scan this thing I really do I can't scan it either I can't I can't do nothing to this thing Interesting. Oh, oh, this, it's like leaving, do you swim with the current, it said. Do I have to get behind it? Because it looks like it's seeping out that stuff that cures me, right? That, that enzyme?
Oh, these were the things that... Remember, there was these glowing fish. Remember the glowing fish that I had seen? And they seemed to have, like, enzyme whatever it said on it. I bet you they were... They contained this thing. Like, these guys right here. These fish that swim through this stuff. Oh, jeez. I mean, if I just swim behind this thing, will I get, a, like, a rush? What am I supposed to do here? <laughs> I mean, this is all well and good. I mean, this looks cool. But what am I actually supposed to be doing here? Probably thousand leagues under the sea. Are these eggs? Sea Emperor eggs. Environment uh, scans indicate the water here is rich with a rare plankton-like life form, which depends on the organic detritus produced by the ecosystem around it. Thirty seconds. Okay, incubator. Let me, yeah, let me go get some oxygen. I've, I'm, there's some things going on here. Oh, I don't think I can get out of here even if I wanted to. Okay, let's get back down there then. Can I take one of the sea dragon eggs? Is she going to be mad at me if I just stripe steal one of her eggs? All these aggressive fauna are not aggressive right now. Oh, there's also an air thing right there. Nifty. Okay. And right here. They're all over the place. I don't know why I was running to the surface and panicking. Okay, no, I can't take these anyway. It's nifty. Okay, well, my prawn suit's up there, so I kind of want to get it. All right, let's uh, let's get going over here. Oh, is this uh, is this a stargate? It looks like it is, or was. It looks like it's buried now. Aluminum uh, aquarium arch. Uh, scans indicated the arch was left inactive when the facility was abandoned. It's likely severed or served as an access point to the surface of the planet. Much too small for the emperor to pass through. It would accommodate smaller life forms. How do I clean this off? A uh, big uh, emperor lady, miss. You want to clean that off for me, please? Okay, uh, let's go over here. So this is cool and all, but now I'm stuck in here. Unless there's some way to get out of here. Maybe she has to eat me? I had to pass through a digestive system to get cured? I don't know. Just a thought. Or is there actually like caves underneath here someplace? Oh, hold on. There is actually a cave underneath here. Plant life in this area is growing outside its normal conditions. Other life forms fertilizing and pruning the vegetation may be offsetting this environmental deficit. Sea crown. I don't think I've ever seen this. Let me see. Can I get a plant? Yeah, I can get a plant sample of that. Oh, here's a here's one of these things. Ion cubes. Does this lead outside? And am I safe? And will I have enough oxygen to get out of here? No, nope, leads right back into this area. Nifty. Okay, Miss Emperor Lady. Um, what do I do? <laughs> it was it was nice to meet, very nice to meet you and all. But oh wait, maybe go through the gigantic door. That might be it. You know, there's a vent right there. Oh, here's a here's a thing. Oh, I happen to have found a cube uh, uh, down there. Nifty. It's almost like the game developer put one there in case you jumped in here without. Without it. Okay, so here's the portal. Cool. Oh, there's also a cube right here. Look at that. Um, let me grab this thing, too. Um, there's a portal leading someplace, that's for sure. But the problem is where and how do I get my prawn suit back? Or do I not? Is that, is that the thing? I also didn't get cured, as far as I know. Let me actually look. Maybe I haven't actually done a self-scan in a while. No, I'm still definitely infected. Um... All right, let's go through here and see where this takes us, and then come back in here and try to figure out where, I'm how I'm supposed to cure myself. It looks like enzyme 42 is how I cure myself, and it's seeping out the back of that thing. Oh, there's, oh, oh, okay, it takes me out of the, okay, that makes a lot of sense. <laughs> okay. How do I get down from here, though? Other than just jump and break my legs. I mean, I'll jump and break my legs, but I didn't. I didn't get anything answered. Hold on, I gotta go back in there. There are vents here. I don't know if I really want to get sucked up in that. Uh, Miss Emperor D Dragon Lady, what am I supposed to do? Do I want me to eat this peeper? Is that it? Uh, I don't want to eat that thing because it'll actually hurt me. I don't know what to do. All right, I'm gonna have to look this thing up because. I clearly am not doing the right thing, so give me one second. A few moments later. Alright, people, I got an answer. 
And boy, is it going to be a tricky one. Um, I need to create a hatching enzyme, it would seem. Where did it tell me? Did, this, did it tell me this in here? And I was like just blowing through it so fast I didn't realize. Uh, I probably did. Alien eggs. Hatching enzymes right there. Bam. Mm-hmm. Okay. I need to create one of these, uh, some hatching enzymes to get these things to actually be born. And I need to actually hatch the, uh, the, the emperor's eggs. Nifty. Okay, so that's kind of cool. At least now I have, I have a direction. I'm not wandering aimlessly. All right, so one of the things that I need to actually collect is the thing I collected, actually. To create these hatching enzymes, I have to go pick some flowers all around. No, not flowers, but some plants. I gotta pick some plants all around the place. Uh, they're the things that this thing needs to, uh, or that that's what I need to make that, that enzyme stuff. Now, one of them was right down here. It was this stuff, all right? Now, I'm gonna actually snag another one of them, sea crown. I'm gonna grab another one, because then I can actually plant that on, like, the surface. Uh, and create a garden. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to figure out how to get out of here safely-ish. And then apparently all of these teleporting, uh, all these uh, stargates that are on the air, uh, are on the area. Oh, excuse me, uh, miss. Uh, that are in the area, uh, they all lead to areas that have uh, more uh, flowers or more plants than they need. So I need to actually get out of here. So I need to find my way back to back to. Where was it? I think it was over here. I need to find my way back out of here. And I need to return... I'm going to need to grab all these flowers and then return to uh, the Lost River Fob. I should have built a fob down here, actually, to be honest. But to return to the Lost River Fob, because that's the only place that I have a fabricator. <laughs> and that's what I need, is I need a fabricator to make this. So, all right, I'm going to get out and work on getting back to the, the teleporters and see if I can't find all of these flowers or all these plants. And then we should be able to... Uh, make this uh, enzyme. All right, door number one, gate number one. Let's go through it and see where this one takes us and what plant I'm looking for. Right there, that's one right there. The eye stalk, thing glowing right there. I need that. Grab a couple of them. Swim right back where I came because there's. It sounds like there's some terrible stuff out here. Bam. Okay, got the eye stalks. All right, so that's one. I grabbed two seeds because I plan on making a farm out of these guys uh, when I'm done with this. Door number two. It's one of these plants around here I need. Oh, I think it's this stuff right here. That's the stuff I need right there. I don't know if I've ever scanned this before. Yeah, I have. All right, let's get this. Got it. All right, get back in here. Get back in here before those things eat me. It suddenly makes a lot of sense why all these portals are here. All right, in through gate number three. Can I get a sample of the of the big fungus? Is that is that it? Oh, can is that it? Is that it? Fungal sample. Yeah, that is part of it. I'm gonna grab two of those things. I don't know if I can actually grow those. All right, we got the fungal sample. That was one of the things we needed. All right, let's get back to the facility. All right, fourth and final door here. Fourth and final gate. We're heading to here. We're looking for a bulb bush. There's some bulbs right there. That'll work. That's all I need. Actually, I haven't scanned these yet. There's some terrible sounding thing. Okay, there we go. Get a couple of those. Bam. This thing is probably going to try to eat me. And I would say, ha, you can't get me, except for it totally can. Remember, it can totally come in here for some reason, despite it not having any water. All right, were those it? Yeah, old bulb bush samples. It's all right. It's all right if they're old. I don't really care. Looks like you can eat those things, though. All right, let's get back to the facility. That should be everything that I need to create this uh, this enzyme, this uh, or this incubator habitat, whatever the, the eggs need to hatch. <laughs> Hatching enzymes, that's what I, oh, I meant to say. All right, let's go ahead and not consume switch containers. I gotta make sure I don't skip. All right, so these, the fungal samples, and then the, these four things right here. So the five items right there, that's what I needed to collect. Now, I need to make my way back to a place with a fabricator. So I gotta work my way back to the Lost River Fob, basically. So give me a second to do my Spider-Man thing to get back there, and then I'll catch right back up with you guys. We're almost there, almost cured. 
No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Shoot, bad, bad. Get away, get away. Shoot, bad, bad, bad. Yes, sea dragons and sea emperors are apparently two different things. I learned this now, in the final hour. Stupid warper. Stupid warper! Come on, leave me alone, man! I'm telling you, you could have avoided all of this if you would have just left me alone. Almost back. I'm almost there. Alright, I finally made it back. Whew. Alright, I should have all the samples actually on me. Let's go check this out and see if I can actually make this. Oh, I don't see anything that says that I can... I can make this here. Are you kidding me? Don't tell me I, I came all the way back here and I can't even make it yet. Come on. Alright, people. I'm not sure what I'm missing here, but I can't actually make the thing that we were trying to make in this episode. I think I'm going to have to do a little bit of uh, research and I probably have to pick up with this one in the next episode because this recording session is getting ridiculously long. I do have all the uh, materials I need to make it. It's not showing up. It says something about, like, on online, it says something about how the uh, the blueprint shows up after you've uh, ex uh, ignited the archway, which I did. So I don't really know what I'm doing. Maybe it's the one that's covered in sand. Maybe I have to somehow ignite that one. I don't know how I'm going to do that, but, I mean, I, I, I'll try to figure it out. But, all right, you guys, I'm going to wrap this episode up here. Unfortunately, we're not going to cure ourselves in this one. I was really trying to. So, But thank you guys so much for donating your eyeballs and ear holes to this episode. I will catch you guys in the next one where hopefully I have some answers. Thanks again for watching, and bye-bye.